Welcome back to the vlog, you guys. Today we have a day that every snowmobiler dreads, and it's this. Cleaning up the sleds for the season. That's right, you guys. I am done riding for the season, so that means that today we are going to take the sled on the driveway, hose it off, give it a coat of wax, and just clean it up, grease it, get it ready for next season so we can store it properly so we don't have any issues next year. Um, obviously, nobody wants to do this. Nobody wants to put their sled away for the summer, but unfortunately, it's 70 out and I'm done riding for the season. So today's the day we're gonna give this a nice foam can and wash, clean everything up, fix any scratches, some touch up paint, and get her ready for next season. So as you guys can see from my last ride, I got a bunch of mud up in the rails and on the uh, running boards, tunnel. There's mud everywhere on this slide because I rode it in like kind of wet snow and the ground wasn't frozen. So there's mud everywhere. Got scratches all along here from trees and like just a bunch of other shit in the paint. Like this is cracked here, there's scratches on here. Probably just because I ride so fucking hard, but like, yeah, we got another chip here. We're gonna touch all this stuff. I got a chip back here. But yeah, we're gonna touch all this up today. the sled off I'm gonna use car wash soap just a basic sponge and also a bristle brush to clean the a arms rails and the snow flap everything else that the sponge would like rip on or not get very well since I don't have a foam cannon like with the pressure washer I just have a hose I'm gonna be using the Adams polishers foam gun what's nice about this is it actually hooks up to the hose and uses hose pressure to put foam in your car sled so you don't need a pressure washer Alright, now that the sled is all foamed out, we're gonna get to scrubbing with the brushes.
All right, so now the sled is all dry, I'm gonna go ahead and use Adam's Polish and Spray Wax on it. Just give it a nice protective coating and uh, polish up the finish just a little bit. So what I did is I took this touch-up paint here I got from, I forgot what website it was, but it was only like 14 or 15 bucks for the exact color code of my sled there. And I touched up the rails in a few spots on the panels. Um, it's an exact match. It's a little bit hard because it's a thick paint, but it looks pretty good and better than having like exposed chips on there. And just like that, you guys, all the sleds are packed away for the summer. All right, guys, and that's it for the season. That ends the season. Sleds are put away. We are done with snowmobile videos for a while on this channel. I want to take a quick second to say thank you to you. You guys watching this video. Um, when I got this sled to now, I have gained a ridiculous amount of following just because of that sled and the videos I made. I want to say thank you to you for watching the videos every time I uploaded, commenting, giving me help, tips on my sled. Without you guys, like honestly, I wouldn't have the motivation to come out and make these videos because it was really cool watching the following grow and seeing regular people comment seeing different names, seeing new people, the same people, it was awesome. And I just wanna say a quick thank you to each and every one of you guys that came along this journey this winter with the 850. Um, it was awesome and next winter, it's gonna be even better. We're gonna have way better riding videos. We're gonna go riding more. Um, I didn't go as much as I wanted to this year, to be honest, you guys. And next year, it's gonna be different. I'm gonna try to get out there more and ride more. But I just wanna take a quick second to say thank you for each and every one of you guys that came along on this journey this winter with this new sled. I appreciate all you guys. And I hope you guys stick around for some of these car videos and some other stuff we're doing with like the motorcycles and everything. So it's gonna be fun. It's a little bit different. I know you guys are here for the sleds, but give the car stuff a try, you guys. It's uh, we do We have a really good time at these car meets. We do a lot of fun stuff. So hopefully you guys check out a car video or two maybe or a motorcycle video. If not, I will see you guys next winter. Thank you guys for watching the videos and support me throughout this winter. It was awesome. I will have a few other riding videos scattered here and there. Um, some clips I just never use, some rando clips. So look out for those. But if you guys are here just for the sled videos, thank you guys for watching this winter, and I will catch you guys next season. And that's going to be a wrap on today's video, guys. If you guys liked today's video, smash a huge thumbs up. Uh, comment down below some video ideas for me, as always, and just say what's up. That's cool, too. And if you guys are new here or been watching for a while, go down below and hit that red subscribe button, and I'll catch you guys next video. Peace out. Riding with the top down, yeah I'm with my shorty, she gon' drop down, yeah I'm on a high, I'm feeling way up, yeah I'm in that new fit, looking laced up, yeah